welcome to the whiskey.com news on the 24th of July 2018. It's a bit of a slow news week. We only have four news this week, but there are some interesting ones. So we start off in Scotland with Diageo. Diageo is releasing eight single malt whiskies for the Game of Thrones series. Yeah, the the bottlings or the, the single malts will correlate to the houses in the series. House Targaryen, Lannister, Stark and so on and so on. As there are only seven great houses, uh, the last one is dedicated to the Night Watch. Yeah, and they will be released in, uh, in September or something like that, in autumn. And this will correlate to the release of the Johnny Walker White Walker. So we have the, the good single molds and the evil blend White Walker from Johnny Walker. Yeah, let's find out how good they are. And I'm really excited to know if uh, find out if they are actually special bottlings or if they are just standard bottlings with a new label on it. Yeah, so to come to a bit more real news. The Raze distillery on the same name island, it's about a bit north of the Isle of Skye, they are celebrating their second planting of barley. And the first harvest they are now doing at an yeah, open day, they will mash it on that open day. So um, they had planted five different types of barley and they harvested three of them because hmm, probably the other ones didn't grow that well. And now they're really proud that they have their own barley and making a celebration for that. Uh, this year they will plant four of them, four um, barleys, and they want to plan, uh, plant so many of them that they can actually get a, f a full batch of single malt scotch whiskey from this own grown barley. Hopefully that will end up well and we'll have a good Scotch malt whiskey from Raze. Yeah, so much for Scotland and now we move uh, to Japan. Yeah, the Enzo. The Enzo uh, is the Japanese word for circle, which is the highest symbol in the, um, in the Zen religion. So um, what is it? It's a pure pot still blend. And they really don't say what distilleries they get the, the malt from. So it's kind of a, a mystery. But we can maybe tell a bit from where the whiskey comes from. It's, uh, I have to cheat on that one. It comes from Kyokawa. Kyokawa is a region that is just between Tokyo and Gontemba. Gontemba is the city uh, at the foot of the Mount Fuji and it's a rural region and they want to have the the combination of rural and tradition with the city and the whole new high-tech and yeah just new stuff. So um, hopefully that will end up in a very good whiskey. I'm not sure how much of that comes from the international market but it will launch in Germany next week. So thank you very much for watching. If you found this video interesting, then please feel free to share it with your friends and see you next week.